What's up guys, hope you're doing great, this is your boy Copicious. In today's video, we're going to look at how we can color grade some few footages with just two LUTs, which I've provided down in the description below. So if you're interested in this sort of a video, kindly subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notification button, sit through to the end and enjoy. Alright, so in Adobe Premiere Pro, I'm going to use Lumetri Color with my LUTs. So with the LUTs, I've provided a link down in the description below so you can do yourself a favor and go download it. Alright, so the very first thing that I do anytime I have my footages lined up over here on my sequence is that I create, of course, an adjustment layer. And once the adjustment layer is created, I drag it and place it on top of the footages and make sure that it lines up and it moves all the way to the last end. Okay, so I'm going to duplicate it by holding Alt key and dragging the adjustment layer up to the top layer. Once I have my adjustment layers created, I'm going to find the hero shots of all these footages. Okay, so I have three of them. So let's find a hero shot for this footage. Okay, so I think this just works for me. All right, and um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the color tab and find my LUT in the creative tab. Okay, so I'm going to use selected color grid for my films, which I have left a link down in the description below so you can download it once more. All right, so I'm going to start with the Rec 709 LUT. That's going to give me the base um, color grade for my shots okay and they look decent the skin tones look perfectly um, lined up it looks decent and even the environment also looks decent okay so the second adjustment layer is going to have my second LUT. i'm going to go through the same process orange and teal lights and i'm going to select this and redly they appear nice and that's because they are well lit so in a situation where your shot is not really well lit. You're going to have to go through a lot of adjustments to be able to arrive at a shot just like this. Okay. All right. So what I have on these uh, adjustment layers are going to be left alone and I'm going to deal with the footages themselves. All right. So let's get back to the hero shot. All right. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some few adjustments. So starting with shadows open it up a little bit then I'm going to deal with the highlights a little bit and bring them down and increase my contrast just a bit all right I'm not going to touch saturation because already the shot looks saturated but I'm going to um, individually work on the color separately all right so we're going to start with the sky I'm going to increase the blues in the sky just a bit okay and um, I'm going to equally do that to the skin just a bit to make it pop. Beautiful, All right? And I'm happy with this shot because uh, look at, at the environment. You notice that there's a lot of color separation. If I'm going to find some orange, it's going to definitely be probably over here on the coconut as well as maybe on the rock they are sitting on. And uh, yeah, in the background, some elements back there in the background. Okay, so with that done, I'm going to alter the hue of the sky just a bit, maybe to the tears just slightly, like so. And I think I'm quite okay with the footage, how it looks like so far. Beautiful. All right, so to make things much easier for me and not to go through everything just like the processes I went through with this shot, I'm going to simply select the Lumetri color, copy the properties, and just drop them right over here onto this shot. And I'm going to do the same to you on this shot. But I notice that they don't look good instantly like they do over here because they are in different situations the light and, and even the camera settings are also definitely different all right so i'm going to have to make some micro adjustments separately to this shot as well because i'm going to increase the whites a little bit the highlights not too much just like so i'm going to go down and adjust the hue luma of the skin we increase just a bit slightly not too much if you do too much you notice that it deteriorates the shot okay so somewhere over here just looks good and uh i think it matches with the exposure the vibrance the contrast and everything works perfectly well all right on to the last footage 
let me find the hero shot I think this works all right and um, I'm going to equally increase the whites to make sure that there's some exposure in there because I lagged it okay so a little bit of a highlight and I think I don't have to do so much to this footage let's see if they match in terms of exposure okay perfect and all these shots match perfectly well with the color so let's quickly do a before and after so this is before and after before after before and after all right so these look perfectly well and i'm so happy with the few adjustments that we could do to make these footages look so good and they pop real well with just two lads that I've provided down the description below so if you're interested kindly do yourself a favor and download it and until the next video i'm gonna catch you later don't forget to subscribe see you in the next video